to another episode of Sips with Melly. And today I have my homeboy, the artist, the gang, 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 gang. Pretty. What's good, shorty? What's good? You good? I cool. You real? Just day living. <laughs> Taking one soak a day at a time. <laughs> <laughs> so you're a superstar right now. Right, right. Oh, I superstar. You see your your, your shades are your high your low oh, nipples light. ready to come out. I'm gonna pull out some sorry. I'm supposed to supposed to form a PC. Alright, alright, this, this, yeah. this, 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 this is a serious, serious interview, okay? I apologize. <laughs> Let it blow that out. Ah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So let's start from the beginning, right? Amen. Yeah, dog. We have to start from the beginning. Where did you grow up? Maloney. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. what made you start to do music? Right. <laughs> <What? What? laughs> nah, nah, nah. I always felt like I wanted to be an artist, you know, like it, you know, just sometimes you just have a calling. You know, like you're meant to do this no matter what you do, no matter what direction you turn, you just end up back in your time. I feel like that's how it was for music. Yeah. I feel like it was your personality when you were young as big as it is now. Yeah, I was a jackass. Oh, yes, oh, yes. I was a class clown, labels, stamped, sealed. <laughs> We've been friends for like what, seven years? Yeah. It's like seven years, and this has been like your personality has been this. I'm trying to say that was done. So I'm just thinking, like, when you were small, if you had this personality, this is a lot. Uh, I had a jackass long time. <laughs> I guess it's been an instant entry for cussing at each other. What? Yeah. Kids don't do that. But like, okay. it wasn't a curse, like, so. You know, your mother saw and so. <laughs> it was like, I was just lying in and mm-hmm. he, he, the other thing used to come and flick your ribs hard. Do it like that. What the fuck? What's up? You didn't get it. <laughs> you <laughs> didn't realize the mother. Your were like, good. But it was cool. That one, I don't know how to be a cuss, but. <laughs> but I feel like you can crack a joke and get out of everything because you always like. I think we laugh at the dumbest stuff, like it's always something to laugh. It's serious and it's to laugh at, like, you will do serious, like, people falling on again and the that, and the drinking, and it's vegans. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to go through that, I want to be known, so I want to live and be happy. So just laugh all the time. As much as possible. Okay, so where, what was the first... What was the first performance you ever had? Like what? Yeah. Preschool. Really? Yeah, like I like been hitting the streets, bro. <laughs> you be, you been performing since preschool? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I performed for my graduation, my preschool graduation, greatest love of all. What about like in secondary school? Did you used to perform? I performed in a tree too. Like I wrote my first song when I was in front of tree. Secondary school, I got junior soccer, and I was still so writing a little bit, but I wasn't heavy on the competition because I was trying to do it. And what was the, what would you consider the first stage of you saying something? Um, soccer star. I went out, no, 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 not soccer star. I was in TNT, I'm going to dance with you. I went out, thought I was the regular boss. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Okay, and what you used to dance to artists? You yeah, used to... I danced for Skinny Fabulous, Shal, in Soka Monarch. I danced for a couple of other artists in Soka Monarch. It was fun for a while, but you know, your bills wasn't getting paid or anything. I didn't feel like it, it was for me now, so it I wasn't your calling. Yeah, I walk away from that and walk away from the dance big thing. And then after, <clears throat> you know, I tried out for Soka Star, made it to the finals, you know, I came second to last. So that was that was a blue to my pride, but <laughs> you know, I don't know about that. The right. journey, yeah. yeah. But okay, so I know like me and you have had the conversation of like you doing You know, I know it's what I fall on. Good job. I, just, I was gonna good do job, so. buddy. Good 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 job. Good don't you have did you do this in a photo shoot? Like recently? Because I'll be now, I'll be professional. I mean you just dropped my mic. 
Is that my that eh, really eh, mic? Eh, eh, yeah. eh, 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 the bass mic. Eh, okay. Pick up, pick up the bass. <laughs> nice property. Okay, so we have had this conversation of like how long you did it before you actually were saying something, mm. and how you wanted to quit. Yeah. Just let the people know, like, how long before you actually you were singing, and what was the turnaround? So everybody watching this at home, I would like you to go and take out the scientific calculators, find a white piece of paper, and get a pen, a T square, set square, from a German she said, and the old Chinese man in the corner who just counts all the top of head because <laughs> I can't tell you how long I've been getting this shit <laughs> to make it out here. I still feel like I eat the doggos. <laughs> so I don't know what she talking about. Like you done make it. Like it's no. like. No. Remember when we was having the conversation? Like you were like you you were gonna go get a rag. You were gonna quit. Oh yeah. You were going to because you you know I yeah, mean like, I is, know like that has happened like you just haven't and you, that happens a lot. Yeah. But I feel like it, it will continue to happen. I'm like, talking about when, when, when you had before you when you I had was like working for like fifteen hundred a month. Yeah. Um, I was going to school. I was doing master's degree in Costa Rica. Um, okay. I was, you know, not writing for Marshall and things. Like. You know, it was good. It was fun. But then after, like, you know, my my girl ended up getting pregnant, and I was like, shit. Can chill and go. We will bleep that. We will bleep that. No, you're not. You uh, can curse this one. It's yes. I no, 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 no. You you cannot curse. You cannot curse. Lee. You can curse. Thumbs up, thumbs up. You can I curse. could kiss. Fucking hell, boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> could be real, no. It could be fucking oh real thing. So yeah, let me see my dog. <laughs> no. My songs are handball and I was fucking good. I was like, hey, what the hell I gonna do this, boy? Um, you know, coming from Maloney, I really feel like you don't have any options and like when you get to and and, it, and it's a problem like with generational cases and things where people talk about it's just, you know, parents not preparing a trend to deal with the realities of life. They just feel like sending a trend to fucking school go do that, but school not teaching your financial responsibility and being patient and fucking paying your tickets and then going to court. <laughs> you know, you went to talk to the police and went on she ass. You know? That's still the lesson. That is five. That is, that is, that is, you know, real world things. And, like, at that point, I was ready to stop. I went and I was, like, my, um, your family had a security firm. And, like, in my life, there's three times, like, I walk away from, <laughs> like, stuff. There was the one time when I was supposed to go and do Coast Guard exams. I walk away from that, jump in the car, and went straight home to my mom, and I was too short, and it turned out too slow. Um, then when I was, right before my son was born, I was um, going on um, audition for Amalgamator, which is like a big security film in Trinidad. And like I went and did it, and when I walk in, I see this man watching the car. Not that I have anything against it, eh? and I watch him and I was like, boy, that, that, that could probably be me in the next 15 years. And, you know, will I be happy? And my son will be taken care of because I will to stick and do it, but will I be happy you now? You know? And I decided to take the gamble and just, you know, go and do my own thing. And it has not been easy since then, but I need to get the decision, you know? Yeah. So. You see, the thing about it, you're following your heart and the, your dream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, that and all, is a strength in its own. Because it's it's a very hard thing to do. Just having a conversation between following your dreams is... Either it can be viewed as strength, weakness, not strength, weakness, or either insanity or passion. Yeah. Oh. Like, what don't I do? I show I love mad. <laughs> I feel, that's how I feel too. Nah, I you feel... well, mad. You well, mad. <laughs> <laughs> you well, well, okay. <laughs> you good, man. What you like? Oh, mad people laugh. I, I see that laugh. Like, yeah, because like, for you to pick, like, for me to pick to be an artist, I, I can definitely say it's the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. It's just the hardest thing. Yeah. Like, like you had to push shame aside and thing at certain yeah. points. You know, you used to be performing in front of a man. And nobody moving. You whining like, your heart, your poor heart. Singing. Singing. And, and I'm understand watching you like you. You's a potato. <laughs> <laughs> you's a potato as <laughs> Hey, everybody, thank you. <laughs> you had to roll your potato ass off stage and go forward. <laughs> Crickets. Bye.
shit hard. Nobody can tell me that. Uh, it is such a hard thing, yeah, but man. like, it takes a lot to even do it. You know what I mean? And the thing about it, you are consistent. You keep pushing. And to me, not because you're like one of my bestest people. I wouldn't say best friend, but you're like one of my bestest people. I I see how how it is. You know what I mean? And I see your growth. And I see how hard you work. Yeah. And it's admirable. Yeah, that is also, you know? Yeah. So this still only lies to get paid. So. No, it does not. It's always and you above. have a whole child to take care of. Yeah, yeah. Like for me, like I really want to see if I can win. Not see. I want to win a Grammy. And I don't want to win a Grammy for will win Grammy. just winning a Grammy seat, you know? Because like after you compete in Super Monarch and it road match and all these things every single year, like what is the long term plan? Yep. Uh, no, and that is my long term plan to see if I can at least leave a stamp for the world. The person that did something for the culture, you know? Yeah. The culture is definitely doing something for me. You know, as a man, if it, if it would, if it, if the culture can help me get a bus with pass, like that would be amazing. But uh, <laughs> but everything else, the culture did for me. I appreciate it, so uh -huh. I will give back to the culture. You know? Yeah, I mean, despite where we go in the world, we're representing Trinidad and Tobago. Mm -hmm. We are like this is where we live. This is where we were born. This is our home. This is, you know what I mean? This is the Trini, we are Trinis. You know what I mean? So despite where we go in the world, we're always going to represent where we come from. You know yeah. what I mean? A lot of time it's just making the people According to her, because if I'm not running up a uh, bank with a fucking gun or boy, I'm going to kill every Trini here. Oh Miss God. Miss <laughs> Cheese or oh, bread, I ain't <laughs> no nothing. <laughs> but now you better go and get the Trini across there. I ain't no chin, I bitch on I done, I'm not doing it. You're so stupid. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I get that. But the thing about it, at least you're setting goals to yourself. So when you set goals, now it's just for you to knock them down yeah, and to man. come up with a plan on how to execute it. You know what I mean? Yeah, man, yeah, man. So and that's also time. Yeah, yeah. You know what yeah, I mean? yeah. That's also time. But what ha what what's your scene for the season? What have you released? Like? Um, the bad, the bad is doing amazing. Oh, I um, love that song. Thankful for that, young and restless. Young and restless is also in the works of building to be one of the monsters. Ah. Yeah. Share it with Ola Tunji, which is a power. We're dropping a video soon. And my ultimate favorite creeper. This is, I don't know how it would have been my favorite, but I tried. Um, which is an extreme movie. I say extreme, boy. It's a man can I sing that song. You talking about the one with that? And Kissy. And Nini Ola. Oh, yeah. So, so that, that one kind of squeezing into my favorite. Precision. Um, at the end of this month, um, January 31st, I have Chance coming up. I know yes. the leaders only drink Hennessy, so we gain VIP passes, you know? Oh, we, we uh, should I be acting for my, for my, my, my I'm performing. So, shouldn't I get a yeah, bottle? Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Are you want bottles? When your, when your own friend big time here. You want bottles? I didn't say bottles, I said bottles. What that? You just say you need to hydrate. Okay, get it. So, chance is coming up. I'm definitely going to compete in Soka Monarch this year. And this year, I want to kind of make a statement that um, I, just, I always fight up with being typecasted or stereotype of. Uh, what kind of typecasted? I, I know, boy. Just Cast. like the general or the typical or another Soka artist. I don't want to be considered another because I'm not aiming to just be. A uh, uh, soca or to sit back and just feed or drop a one song here and just feed and just feed, you know. But you, but you, you, I feel like, I feel like your content, especially this year, is saying that you're different. Yeah, but at the, at the end of the day, um, your view, my view, views of the people and views are being much more different. Very. Cool. So I could convince you because you just be wrong, and I could convince the people because the same thing. Then the views of the industry is a whole different. So are you trying to like convince the industry? I feel like I'm trying less to convince and just no more getting comfortable. 
is be you my own thing um my only thing is i just want to ensure that i do it the right way i want to put on a proper foundation that i can always come to in times of unsurety and when i need to go back i remember what i did last year and before when i in hammocks and stuff and you know so foundation solid man and chance chance doing here. your thing yeah 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 okay okay is that your phone what <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Check your phone or your phone. My phone is off the set, like I told you to do before you got on set. What? <laughs> you see your phone start vibrating. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, guys, this is literally how we are, like, probably like every day. Like, this is the door, okay? But, okay, so they, what should they expect from you? What's next? Dynamic Other performances. Than your show coming. Um, dynamic performances. I definitely look into enjoy my performance more and be a little bit more free spirited. Um, look out for probably some stage dives. Seen as fear and drop that dive song. You know, I think it's like it's okay. It's permitted. Woo! So look out for those things. And um, uh, the elevation is happening, man. It, yeah. Like it's happening. Um, you know. Yeah, I must make a real terrible analogy. Dog, I feel like you should tell me how to open the camera. Oh no no no! Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bad analogy. So let's look out for good energy, good vibes. You know, I, I, I definitely I'm happy to to consistently be showing that you know I am here for the long run, and um. I appreciate the love, you know, you boys are lover. You all out in the pools outside, you know, we just do. <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah. Okay, oh, I wanted to ask you a question now, um, before we close it off. How do you feel about the dance hall in so um the soca? And do you feel like also outside of the season it should be more soca? Hell yeah. Like I release I wanna yeah, just I release year round consistently. But do you release soca or you release um something that would appease I release, I don't really, uh, well, I'm not that I don't really soak out all the season, but I tend to put the energy in something different. I, I, I let the festival, because you have to understand it, like, the, or, the origin of carnival and the festivities was always meant to, like, to be a break. More, yeah, to be yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. I think that that's good, because there's nothing like it. Yeah. I feel like soca year round would, would be us selling each other, selling each other a dream. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> no, it vibrates yeah. on the camera. Man, At you, least it's not. For your phone. It's not on. Look for your dog in your phone too, like this. Is it shaking? Okay. It's not, it's so, not. Uh, I feel like uh, what was it? you were saying like it's a break outside of. The oh yeah, yeah. Now. So, um, carnival has been set. It, it it was introduced to be like a break, you know. And outside of the season, like I did songs like blessings. I did songs like pray. I did songs like say. Yeah. And it didn't take on a soca aspect, but I didn't switch up my dialogue or anything to try and portray what I'm not. And I feel like that is needed outside the season. Like, it's okay. Like, we can do soca outside the season also, but don't expect it to be as big during the season because there's no stages for soca outside the season. So I think, like, we had to set up the stages also. Right. So for me, I don't have no problem with, with this just being in the carnival. I just think regulation and I would like to see the content in this become a little bit diluted a little bit. Because we are just we are to keep in mind that like a lot of this kind of music is banned in Jamaica and in junior years for a reason. And yes, we want to follow trends, but understand that in terms of following trends, what doors that we are opening up. Right. So yeah, yeah, man, you think good, man. I says, I says, I says, wet, wet, wet. All right, tell the people where they can find you on social media. Uh, you can check me out on all social media platforms at Island Boy, I L A N D underscore pretty. You know, love your boy, and um, subscribe to my YouTube page. And his show pretty. is on the 31st, yes, yes, the 31st of June, Song Forge, and it will you be said, the 31st of January. January. Thank so, June. you, yes. 31st of January. January. I don't know. I don't know what happened. Here. So, 31st of January, and Song Forge is going to be a picture. Real, real amazing. So, come on up. Yeah, guys. Yeah, real hard. 
Red hot. Yeah. You're gonna kill these pigs. Destroy it. I mean, it's our, it's our big stage to kill. I'm sure you will. You're gonna destroy it. Destroy it. You always give a good performance to Silver Monarch, though. Yeah, I kinda like it for you guys. Yeah. Anywho, guys, thank you so much for joining us on this other episode of Sips with Melly. And I will see you guys next week. Don't forget to check out all the episodes on SpeedTheBaseNow.com. And don't forget to follow us on the Base Now Media. And follow me on IG at I am underscore Melly Rose, M E L L Y R O S E. And I will see you guys next week. Bye. 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 Bye